for two days. What is going on? What's going on in TV land? How's everybody doing this morning? Good morning, everybody. I got like three hours of sleep. I woke up. I just kept on driving. I've, I've been driving like a madman now for three, for two days straight, I guess. Just, just driving. I mean, just driving. I'm driving. So I am almost in Arizona. I thought I was in Arizona. I'm not quite. I'm still in New Mexico, but I'm very close to being in Arizona. Where are you guys from? Let me turn on the messages so I can see where everybody's from. All messages are now visible. What's going on, Playboy? What's going on, Playboy? What's up, Playboy? How you doing, huh? I I look like I just woke up because, well, I did. I stopped by a, uh, I went by the, the, the pilot and I got myself my coffee. You know, I, I, I really love the coffee in the morning. Really love the coffee in the morning. Really love it. And, you know, I'm driving along and I had some thoughts. And, you know, the, the, how you guys doing? Good morning, everybody. Good morning. What's going on, Playboy? What is going on? I'll come up with more slogans that people can use. <laughs> What's going on, Playboy? Look at this, man. I'm talking... I am in the middle of nowhere, and it is beautiful out here. Good morning, everybody. Do me a favor. Hit the number one button. Let me know where you're watching from. So, you know, a lot of people ask me, hello, Kansas. What's going on? Oh, good to see you, Myra. Nice to see you. Canada's in the house. Dale, good morning, Dale. How are you, brother? How are things? How are things going? Of course, I do have my auto mode on on my car, so I don't necessarily have to touch the wheel very much. Uh, but I do have to just pay attention as I drive down the road here and just make sure that I stay acutely aware. Denmark's in the house. What's going on, Denmark? How you doing? So, you know, I had this thought. And, and you know, look, we can see now that the Supreme Court, what's going on, Mindy? How are you? What is going on, Flint, Michigan? Ironton, Ohio's in the hizzy. What's going on, Ironton? I can't wait to get a good hour workout in, get all this sweat to pour through my body real fast. What does that say? It says a uh, lot of windshield time, a lot of windshield time. I've been, I've been in this car for two days straight just driving. I mean, I've been just a driving man. Everybody take your finger and hit the like button. Everybody got to take your finger and hit the thumbs up button real quick. Just take your finger like this, that finger right there. Just take it right there. Take that little finger. And you take that finger right there and you reach on over and you just go, what's up, Playboy? And you just tap. You just go, what's up, Playboy? You can even say that, too, when you do it. You go, what's up, Playboy? What's up, Playboy? <laughs> you know, I'll just tell you what. Since I was a kid, since I was a little kid, I have always had this, how do we say uh, big personality. I've always had so much energy that it is incredible. I mean, I have so much energy. It's unbelievable. And I, and I don't really, you know, and I, and I talk to friends and family about this because when you wield an, an, an immense amount of energy that can be translated into an immense amount of power or negativity or happiness or love Oh, man, when I'm in love with a woman, I'll tell you, I am in love. I'm not in love right now. I'm not in love right now. And then last night as I was driving, I listened to a couple of biographies of one of my favorite historical figures, Grover Cleveland. Not a big fan of his presidency. Not a big fan of how he did not get a handle on America. Not a big fan of... A lot of things about Grover Cleveland, so I don't want to sit here and say that I love Grover Cleveland. I just enjoy the personality that Grover Cleveland was. Because I'll tell you what, what's going on, Connecticut. How you doing? Only 32 likes. We got to get to 100. We got to get to 100. And I can't believe, you know, that that I can actually. I can. I can. And this is the reason why I'm doing what I'm doing. So, but we're going to get to 100. I'm divorced. I'm currently... I'm only fingering like buttons. Ha <laughs> ha, Michael, Michael, Michael. Well, you know what? You know what it boils down to now being single, right? What it boils down to is I got to find a woman who is obsessed with the law as much as I am or the opposite and has nothing to do with it, you know, works in a different field completely, really has nothing to do with, with what I do in life um, because 
you know, I, I just, you know, it is what it is. But, you know, I, I think actually, because, you know, it's going to be a real treat. You guys don't know it, but I have a dog. I have a dog that I've left in Los Angeles with some friends for the past little while here. And I'm going to get my dog. You guys are going to see. And you know how I tell you all the time how drug dogs are just a scam? Well, if you could imagine, if you would just imagine for a moment, right? My dog is to levels that other people, when they see how trained my dog is, they go, dude, will you please train my dog? And... And you know what? I just can't. I can't because Chili can't get no girls. Ha, 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 ha. Don, just so you know, my brother, uh, you know, <laughs> that's, that's not true, dude. <laughs> I can if I want to. <laughs> and, you know, I've got a long history, so I am what I am. But uh, that's so funny. My van is a 2018. It's a pretty it's a pretty good van. It's a pretty good van. Oh, Don, 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 Don's talking trash, seven o'clock in the morning. For what? For what, Don? For what, Don? I mean, aren't we ever going to all get along? The answer is no. The answer is emphatically no. So, <laughs> so I guess there's two topics now that I've just kind of rambled over, you know, because I've thought about, you know, joining one of those websites, uh, Uh, one of those dating things, you know, I just, I just, I don't get the feeling for the feeling of a flavor of a Pringles. I just can't get into it. I look at women on dating apps and I'm just like, ah, I've I've thought about joining eHarmony because I did get a really good girlfriend from eHarmony about 10 years ago, a little longer, maybe 12 years ago. What year was that? Shoot. I can't remember. It must have been a while ago, maybe 15 years ago, maybe 12 years ago. I don't remember. I, I need, I, I do need a travel van, but just so you know, I got my bed set up right there, Playboy, right there, right there. I slept right there last night. You see that right there? I slept right there, and it was glorious. It was glorious. I mean, I slept like a rock. I laid down, and boom, I was out like a light. It took like two seconds flat. I was out. What's going on? What's going on? Oh, Romer, I sure do appreciate your input. Thank you so much, my friend. Thank you so much for your amazing input. Good morning, Chad. Hey, Chad, what's going on, dude? Where you been, man? Where you been, Chad? I missed you, dude. I've not seen Chad around in a hot minute. Um, Cobra Kai, you can hit me up on... Uh, you can hit me up on DM, dude. I'm not going to go into into a good morning eyes on corruption. Hey, I got a video coming out in like 45 minutes. I found that beta male Holman. I found him or beta male Smith. I found him yesterday after I served the the uh, Forney Police Department with their federal civil rights lawsuit. I found him. I found beta male Smith. He had someone pulled over out of the road. And I was like, what the fuck is going on? What is going on? So I jumped out real quick. I got him on camera. Eyes on corruption. What's going on, Playboy? Good morning. Know your rights. What's up, my friend? Dude, know your rights. You and I have some great uh, messages back and forth, dude. I really appreciate your input. Really, I really like it a lot. I'm new to your channel. I'm really enjoying Website is back up. Website is back online. Now, the sad part is do it. Don't do it. Don't you do it. Stupid internet. Stupid internet. I feel great, man. I'm I'm going back to California just for, um, I think I'll be back in California for a little more than a week. I'll be back here for about a week, maybe uh, give or take. I'm, I'm going to stop in Arizona here for the day, for today, and then I'll be heading over to uh, San Diego. San Diego, no one knows what it actually means. It means whale's vagina. <laughs> no, but um, I'm, I'm going back to California right now. Um, I have been, just so you guys know, I spent most of my time past two days driving 
filling out with my thumbs and my talk text more federal litigation paperwork because we can't stop. I mean, we can't stop. No matter what happens, we cannot stop. Don't you dare stop. Don't you stop. What are you stopping for? I'm not stopping. What are you stopping for? Who cares? Why are you stopping? Why are you stopping? Listen, and someone said, call me California. I saw it. Cobra Kai, everybody is acutely aware, my friend. Just don't bring the dude's name up anymore. We're going to handle it through the court of law and move forward, my friend. Just move forward. Can't You can't get caught up with the snakes in the grass. You don't get caught. I have a video that shows how to overturn Terry. You really need to watch it because it's got a, it has a, a it's, 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 there's a graph. It's, it's, it's pretty extensive, but we actually, you know, it seems as though we have to write legislation through the legislative branch of government. And then after that legislation, you know, and if you get to executive power from the governorship, which I think is going to be the fastest way to overturn Terry versus Ohio, then an, an executive of any state can simply say that Terry versus Ohio is not applicable here. It's not applicable here. So that's that's super important that we get to that. Let me find it for you, Peekaboo. I can't remember the name of it. But I was going to do a video with Bobby Law and just go over a graphic and show you guys how we overturn Terry. I still think, though, the fastest way is going to get to executive power and then from the state of that executive, push it outwards, push it outwards and, and then try to try to filter and circulate it to other states. Because the thing is, one number one, Florida, what's up, the tribe? How you doing, man? Where's everybody from? I'm sorry the internet pops in and out a little bit when I'm in the middle of, I think I'm in New Mexico still. I'm not quite sure. I think I'm in New Mexico. I'm 95% sure. Yeah, because New Mexico, right when I hit the border of Arizona, I rip off and I go over to my dentist office. And that's what I do. I can't read that minute. I'm so sorry, man. Just a few words. I can only pick up a word or two at a time because I have to keep my eyes on the road at all times as I drive. Upstate New York. What's up, upstate? Jacksonville, Florida. Man, is Jacksonville as humid as Houston? Because I was just in Houston for a couple of weeks. It was so humid over there. So I, I came on here. Okay, I am in Arizona. I am 100% in Arizona. I'm just, I'm just here in Arizona, just barely on the cusp. I am on my way to Phoenix now. I will be in Phoenix in about, well, about an hour, an hour and a half, something like that, somewhere around there. I will be in Phoenix in about an hour, hour and a half, so I'm looking forward to going that. Well, what I think, just so you know, um, uh, hey, Hunter, what I think is it's going to take Cambridge, England. What is up, Sergeant? Good to see you. Um, what I believe is it's going to take at least one man or one woman or one man and woman ha, 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 or one they them. <laughs> Depends on how you want to be called, I guess. Um, you know, I think it's going to take one person to dedicate their entire life to doing what I do. And I have to meet other like minded people who are what's going on? What's going on? Hand banana. Hand banana. That sounds kind of dirty, to be honest with you. What? What's your name? My name's Hand Banana. What's yours? <laughs> so I think, though, it will take my dedication for the rest of my life, and I will get to executive power. I guarantee it. I will get to executive power. Executive power means governorship. So there's only 50 executives, and those are the governors of each state, and then there's one federal executive, which is the president of the United States. So we have to get to executive power or there'll always be someone above you that says, you can't change policing. You can't make it so they don't touch people. Sure you can. Sure you can. And actually, I just, Yunez in Dallas, I've asked Yunez to build the popper. I've asked him to build the popper. So I hope that he does. You know, he gave me some ideas of how he would build the popper. Yunez is busy. He's, uh, you know, like all of us, we're always borrowing from Peter to pay Paul. We are all, all struggling. There's, you know, if you're super rich and flush, I'm so happy for you. That's amazing. I'm happy for you. God bless you, sir. God bless you, ma'am. But 
most people are borrowing from Peter to pay Paul or they're Peter or Paul and they're loaning the money to their friend and they're waiting for that money to come back. <laughs> so I, I always have to keep the wheels on the car um, as I peekaboo, what's going on? What's going on? So the way it would work, peekaboo, is you would have to have a representative of your state, a, a congressman in Alabama, Massachusetts, you know, Florida, or a representative of the federal government. That, that would be a federal representative from like, either way, it's the same thing. From Illinois is going to be a federal representative or a state representative. And what you would have to get done, and, and this is why I'm going to executive power, is you would have to enter into committee. You have to file a bill in committee. This is how it works. This is, this is the legislative process. You have to write a bill, and then you have to have someone else in government, whether that be state or federal, someone has to then back your bill or co-sponsor your bill. And so then once you have your bill co-sponsored, then you put the, the bill up. Now, I don't know the exact processes of government uh, because I haven't been in government. It's just like in court. I don't know the process of court because I'm just now doing processes of court myself. People always ask me, how many lawsuits have you won? My first lawsuit filed was in April of 2022, so I haven't won any. <laughs> it's going to take a long time. But um, So then you would have to have your local representative or your federal representative what they would have to do is enter the bill and then someone would have to back that bill, a co-sponsor of the bill. And then that bill would go to committee, committee meaning a small number of state representatives or a small number of federal representatives would then review the bill and it would have to get past committee or it would be shelved and put into a box and people would forget about it. But you have to first get past committee. And so the committee of, you know, Democrats and Republicans, which we're going to break that duopoly, I guarantee it, in my life it'll be broken. Because we're seeing it, history is repeating itself. If any of you guys have been following me since TikTok, I said in June of 2021, I'm trying to find the video, I'm just busy. I said in June of 2021, if you think things are tough now, the Supreme Court with two new uh, justices, they're going to do things that are going to make your head spin. That's, I told people that. I told people that. I said, that's what's going to happen. That's what will happen. And that's that's exactly what you're seeing now. So I predicted this. I, I told everybody in June of 2021 that the Supreme Court, because has anybody seen Sheldon Whitehouse's videos on YouTube called Dark Money? If you have not seen those videos, his name is Sheldon Whitehouse. That's literally his name. He is the senator from... Delaware, I believe he's a senator from Delaware, Sheldon Whitehouse has a series of video called Supreme Court Dark Money. Just look up Dark Money by Sheldon Whitehouse. If one of the moderators could put it in the chat, that would be absolutely amazing. That would be amazing. So let me go like this, and let me just, because I can't, um, one second. There it is. And let me make sure this is, I'm only an hour away from where I'm going right now. I'm absolutely ecstatic. I'm so stoked. I'm so stoked. So has, has, has everybody seen that or not seen that? I want everybody to take a look at it and you know, I'll cover it. Actually, that's what I'll do. I'll do a live over it and I'll just cover it. Hand banana. You just got here. I don't even know who you are. I have so many backstabbing, hating trolls. I have backstabbing YouTubers. I have backstabbing Democrats, backstabbing Republicans. I have backstabbing family members. You just got here. <laughs> hand banana. First time I've ever seen your name, hand banana. Hand banana, banana. So you would have to get a bill submitted into committee through a representative of the state or federal government. Then that committee would have to vote to advance that bill to the floor. And then once that bill goes... There you go. Okay. Thanks a lot, Yoshi. Um, then that bill would have to go to the floor 
for a larger vote, and the bill would have to have specific language that would say police, and, and the whole term police has got to go. <laughs> the whole term police has got to go. But then what would happen is, after it gets to the floor, there would be a vote on the floor to take it to the entire house. The house would vote on that bill. And then after that, after the after people voted on the bill, it would then get passed to the Senate, whether that be the federal Senate or the state Senate. And remember, I haven't been in government, so if I make errors along the way, but this is pretty much the process. If I'm off, I would love somebody to correct me. I love when I get corrected because I don't want to be wrong. I don't want to be wrong. I do not want to be wrong. God bless you. I don't want to be wrong. And so, so now, but let me, but let me explain to you what's happening. Instead of you running for your local government or your federal government, what's happening is across America, the fraternal order of police is taking retired pigs, funding their campaign you know that whole back the blue flag thing where people donate to back the blue? That goes to the fraternal order of police. And then the fraternal order of police, they're then finding retired pigs who could are electable. And then like the pig in the pig in Arizona here, John Kavanaugh, who sponsored Bill S 2319, and he and he sponsored House Bill. I can't remember. John Kavanaugh, SB Senate Bill 2319. You can look that up. And what these ex-pigs are doing is they are then creating legislation, like you have to create legislation to overturn Terry versus Ohio. And the legislation they're creating, it gives police complete and utter control over the body cam footage. And that's why my email address, Can't Get Body Cam, has a thousand emails in it. If you can't get the body cam, send me an email to can'tgetbodycam at gmail.com. And on the subject line, put the city, state, and police agency that won't release the body cam to you. And that's what you got to do. And so, so you have to become a representative of your state or federal government. And that's the first step. Otherwise, the for, uh, hand banana, I got to see you a few more times. So the answer right now is no, because I don't know who you are. And I have so many haters. I had a rogue mod go through and delete a bunch of people, including Gloria, which Gloria has still not sent me her link. I wrote her back last night and said, send me the link to your channel so I can go through and un... Okay, you guys, uh, we're at 96 likes, 200 people. Let's see if we can get to 100 likes. My numbers are a quarter of what they were because of the defamation. But this goes to show damages. Oh, perfect. Oh, man. Perfect. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got a screenshot of that. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. <laughs> so hit the like button, everybody. So um, you have to get to a place where you are the representative who submits the bill into your local government or into your federal government. So it has to, thank you, Yoshi. It has to be you. You're the one that has to do it. You have to take over your local government by running as a representative. And for the love of God, just wait until I release the third party because I want everybody to run on the new third party. I'm going to release a new third party. I'm going back to Cali to retool for a minute. And then when I head over, I can't release that new third party yet because I have a meeting with um, some people and I don't want to tilt my hand yet what my political persuasions are. So I'm going to wait. It's about a month or two away now because I just can't take the chance on alienating this next group of folks because, you know, uh, my, my buddy, uh, I'm not going to say his name, but one of my moderators, we talked on the phone and he explained to me, um, he explained to me that, that we have to get to the next level. We have to get to the next level. And I mean the next level of funding. That's what I actually mean. Because the folks here who support me and say, you know, 
keep going chili and they throw in five or 10 bucks or 20 bucks or 50 bucks or a hundred bucks. That's amazing, man. I'm so super grateful because I'm not going to do anything else. This is what I'm going to do the rest of my life. But, but the whole point is we have to get to that next upper echelon of funding before we get to the mega funding of the millions through, through crowdfunding across the country. But we have to get to that next level of funding. Oh, there it is, guys. There it is. There it is. Welcome to the great state of Arizona. What's up, Playboy? What's up, Playboy? What's up, Playboy? What's up, Playboy? What's up? Kentucky's in a hizzy. What's going on, Kentucky? I'm going to fight that pig in Kentucky in September. I cannot wait. I got a lot of aggression pent up. I just can't wait. I can't wait. You know, I, and that's the thing, you know, we're raising money for charity for St. Jude's for that fight in September. But if you want to make some money yourself, just so you know, I would bet on me if I were you, if I were you, because I'm going to fight that pig and I'm going to, I think I'm going to knock him out, but he's boxing. So let's see how good his boxing skills are. He's let's, let's see how good his striking skills are. We'll find out, won't we? We will find out. We will find out. So you have to get to. The exe- you have to get into government. And for the love of God, do not run as a Republican or Democrat because both parties are absolute and total crap. They're total crap. You you think that they hate each other, right? Like you think that Hillary Clinton and Donald Trump hate each other? No, they, no, they don't. Hillary Clinton and Donald Trump, they go on camera and they go, I hate you, I hate you too. No, I hate you, right? And then as soon as the camera cuts and they go behind the, the curtain, then they have a drink together and they're like, man, I'm getting so rich. I am getting so rich. And Trump's like, man, I'm getting so much richer. And Hillary is like, oh man, Donald, man, can you believe they buy it that you, we hate each other? Are we still going out to the Bahamas next? Yes, we are. Is that private island still available for us? It sure is, Hillary. A lockdown. And Hillary's like, are there going to be children there that Bill can talk to? That's not fair to Bill Clinton. Although he was friends with with, uh, Jeffrey Epstein, you know, they did hang out. They flew on the plane together. Now, from what I've heard, Billy Clinton was having an affair with Maxine Giswell, whatever her name is. They were apparently having an affair, Billy and Maxine. That's what I heard. That's what I keep hearing. Now, is that true? I don't know the answers. I don't know everything. I'm just a regular old lay person here, a commoner. You know, I'm just like you. You know, I, I'm, I'm going to uh, see my dentist because I still don't have my teeth. I got to get these teeth fixed. I just can't go with these teeth anymore. I got to get my teeth fixed. I mean, I have to get them fixed. So I'm going to see my dentist right now. And my dentist is in Arizona. So that's what I'm doing. That's what I'm doing. And then I'm going to go to Cali. I'm going to go to Cali and get my dog. But it's up to you. You really want to overturn Terry and you should. You should want to overturn Terry with everything that you are, especially if you have children who are going to grow up in this society. And I'm not one of those guys that everything's about the children. I just think that the kids today, because of the Internet, they're just so much more advanced than you and I. They're so much more advanced than you and I. They, they know more than you. You know, and I can just direct you to that one thing that I've talked about before. That website called yourbrainonporn.com which, by the way, that scientist is named Dr. Wilson, and I listened to his entire study. He's got an hour-long lecture. I listened to the whole thing. And, and what he said, and this study is over 10 years old, 15 years old now, he said that he tried to find a control group of 12-year-olds that would... No, I have a dog. I'm going to get it. He tried to find a, a, a control group of 12-year-olds who had not seen pornography, and this is a decade ago, and he could not find a group of 12-year-old boys who had not seen pornography in America. So that means that means that that the kids today know, know far far more than than we ever did. When we, just so you know, I was talking to one of my supporters last night cuz I was on this long ass drive. I'm just, oh man, look at this. That's a beauty, huh? Look at that. That's a beauty. That's a beaut. Look at that. This is that's Tucson, Arizona, right there. That's Tucson, right there. Lo and behold, Tucson. So, 
I was talking to my supporters last night, and he said, he said, you know, that when we were kids, for for us to to see any kind of of smut, I guess you would call it smut. Is it called smutty? Are you smutty? You are a smutty man. So for us to find any kind of pornography when we were children, you had to go behind the mall, look in a dumpster, and you'd find a dirty magazine, or you had the uh, you, you had the um, that back then they had tapes. There was VHS tapes that pornography would be on, and now you just type it right into your phone, and you just go, "There it is," and and you find it just like that. And that's why the kids have all seen it. And this also correlates from the research that I've done. I'm sure people know far more about uh, mid-stage adolescence because there's three stages of adolescence. Mid-stage adolescence, they're saying that the young girls in America and maybe across the world for all I know, I don't know, but the study that I read was that the young girls in America are developing physically faster because their mental capacity is already involved in romantic comedies. And so when they start to articulate the idea of being involved in a romantic comedy with a man, bodies start to develop. Oh, Hand Banana got timed out. I thought Hand Banana wanted a wrench. Hand Banana, you got timed out and you just said a second ago, give me a wrench. Hand Banana, Hand Banana, what the hell are you thinking, Hand? So it's up to you to overturn Terry. Don't you dare think that anybody else is going to do it. Don't rely on me. Don't wait for me to do it. It's up to you to enter into government with one idea and one purpose. I will be the person who submits a bill. Uh, I think, uh, Icarus, I think uh, uh, people are just a little bit, um, a little bit, uh, the moderators are just a little bit protective because, look, man, if I'm not sure if you've noticed or not, Icarus, but, you know, people are saying horrible lies about me. I'm not sure. Did you notice that or not? Did you not notice that? Did you not notice that people are just making up garbage about me? I mean, someone put in here that I was earlier that I was a rapist. Where's my victim? I, there's no victims for me. I went over all my fake criminal record. Where's where's the where's the victims? Where's the victim popping up and saying, no, 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 he hurt me. There's not. There's not. There's not a single one. There's not even one victim. But so that's why uh, Hand Banana got probably got timed out. Maybe a little prematurely. I didn't see what Hand Banana said. But at the same time, I would rather uh, not. I would rather err on the side of caution. Because the moderators are only timing you out. They're only blocking people who are uh, just egregiously horrible. Egregiously horrible. What's going on, Mikel, about change? I just shouted you out, Mikel, about change. What's going on, Playboy? What is going on, Playboy? I just shouted you out, dog. Yoshi! Oh, wow. Was it child, uh, child uh, P-O-R-N jokes? Yeah, that's why you got timed out, Hand Banana. Apparently, you know, there's, you know, you, you gotta, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's not, I'm not down. I'm not down. Oh, gosh. Um, do me a favor, Andrew. I'm, I'm just going to omit that. You know, try not to bring up my, the people who, 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 who don't have the energy that I do. Try not to bring up people who need to siphon my energy like a vampire. Try to bring, try to focus on Terry v. Ohio and whether or not you're going to run for a position where you can submit the bill into your local state where you can then start the process of overturning Terry versus Ohio. I'm trying to explain it, and I, I, I go off like a broken record all the time. The moment Terry versus Ohio is overturned, there is immediate change on the street. There is overwhelming and immediate change on the street the second that we the very first second that Terry versus Ohio is overturned, there's no more pigs going, I'm suspicious of you. There would have to be probable cause only. It would have to be probable cause only. And and just so you guys know, this is my actual passion. Has has anybody seen has anybody seen the the has anybody seen overturned Terry part one, two, and three? <laughs> Good 
Goodbye, hand banana. I thought you wanted a wrench. I thought you loved me. I thought you wanted a wrench. <laughs> so listen, you know, it's really up to you. Don't wait for me to do it. Join me. You know, join me in this because it's the most important thing that there is in America. Making the Supreme Court electable, that's a, that's a huge one. Getting cameras in the courtroom, top notch. West Hollywood, hey, Dina, I'll be in West Hollywood day after tomorrow. I'll, actually, I'll be in West Hollywood uh, early next week if you're going to be around. But you have to hammer, Yochi. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Uh oh, here comes a hammer. Oh, we got a premiere coming out. Got a premiere coming out. You know, I, 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 I'm going to kick this premiere back just about 15, 20 minutes because I have uh, 51 minutes left on this drive. 51 minutes. Where is everybody from? Hit number one button. Everybody hit the like button. We got 220 people. Everybody take your finger and just tap the like button. So, this is what I wanted to talk about, though. I wanted to get into this exact thing. So, I've driven now from Maine to California. I've driven from Arizona to Texas. I've driven from Oregon to Minneapolis. I have driven, I could just keep going on how far I've driven across this country this year. And let me tell you something. When I drive down the road, what I see constantly, Bay City, what's going on? Brian, good to see you, brother Rands. What's going on? What's going on, Rands? How you doing? Good to see you, man. Good to see you. Alan, how you doing, Alan? Good to see you. Leslie Turvey, what's up, Leslie? How you doing? Good to see everybody. And I'm, and I'm passing another pig right here. So as I drive across the country, though, what I continually see over and over and over are just these, these nasty fucking pigs. These nasty pigs. Just drive everywhere you go. There's another pig. And, and so the question I wanted to ask you guys, and this is the reason I came on this live right now, because I'm on an amazing journey. Why do we have so many pigs hiding? Why so many pigs hiding? I just can't get my head, I, I just can't get my head around it. I, I, I don't know why I pass so many pigs hiding on the side of the road. Why? Why are there so many pigs? Freaking pigs in America that they're not they're, they're not out there investigating the the victims of crimes. They're not doing that. The, the pigs in America are hiding on the side of the road to get you. And that it just I tell you what, it just chaps my lips. And I'm, I'm going to try to keep the PG PG 13 here, even though we all know I can break off and be like F, F, F. But I'm trying not to. I'm doing my best to be a good human being. I'm doing my best to be a good human being. You know, I'm trying. I'm trying. I really am I'm trying to be a good person. I'm trying to be a good person so that children don't, you know, and for the children. No, I just, some of my supporters' children watch this channel. And so I don't want to show them, you know, and by the way, you know, when I involve myself with a pig, uh, sometimes my, it just, it just comes out because I just am so disgusted with that human being who signed up to be a part of the Death Star and take you to a dungeon in torture cuffs and you're going to a rape cage. <laughs> you know, I don't know if Pulp Fiction... No, 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 because I saw preachers growing up my whole life. Just so you guys know, I'm 47. I'm about to be 48 in September. And when I grew up, just so you know, I used to watch televangelists on TV. I'm talking when I was a kid. So I'm born in 74. That means by 84, I'm 10 years old. Well, just so you know, not everybody had cable. We didn't have cable. We were poor. So we didn't have cable. There was no cable TV in my home until I was about 12, 10, 10. No, no, I think I was nine. I think I was nine or 10 when cable TV finally got installed in my house. God bless you, 1972. And so, and so when I grew up and the TV, what it would do is it would put these lines on it and it would go, boop, right? And you could turn the channel, but the, Chuck Bronson and the hizzy, what's going on, Playboy? What's going on, Playboy? Chuck Bronson, uh, I need that. Um, I, did you get 
my email, Chuck. Can you send me an email, Chuck Bronson, to delete laws at Gmail? Can you pretty please with cherries and sugar on top? Chuck Bronson, send me an email to delete laws at gmail.com or can't get body cam at Gmail. I'm just putting Chuck Bronson on the line so I know that it's you. So, yeah, that's right. So I used to watch the TV until it went blank. I mean, I watched the TV until it went blank because, you know, I mean, we all have our, our things that we go through in life. I hit snooze on that alarm, and instead of a edit video, I'm going to kick this back just a few minutes. Premiering, it's going to be visibility, and then premiering when, instead of... Oh, no. Oh, man, the premiere is on right now. All right, you guys, let me see if it's on. Let me see if it's on here. Oh, Lordy, Lord, I, 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 I messed it up. I messed it up. Your videos, is the video premiering right now? The premiere is coming on. Uh, we are one minute and 45 seconds from the premiere. I cannot turn it off. I tried to. I tried to change it. There's the premiere link right there. Why don't you guys beat me there? Don't meet me there. Let's go over and watch this premiere, and you guys will get to see me go to Beta Male Smith and explain to him that he just got served a federal civil rights lawsuit. Oh, they're just making money off me, eyes wide open. They're using my energy, the catchphrases I say, like Beta Male, what's up, Playboy. They're just stealing from me. They're stealing my energy. That's all they're doing. That's all they're doing. They don't offer anything. They don't have real justice in their heart. They don't have mean for change in their heart. Just people vampiring your energy. That's that's all it is. It's coming out right now. The new video is coming out in one minute. One minute. I'll see you guys over there. There's 24 people in this chat. You guys post the link real quick and hit that link. And I'm going to turn this, uh, this live off in 40 seconds. And I'm going to watch this premiere with you guys. Oh, God bless you, man. Send me a copy of that, uh, Ramsey. Uh, Ramsey. Ren is send me a copy of that that video that you made you know so you know I have a passion a hunger a, a thrive a drive to change things and and everybody else is just sucking off my energy because they're just low-level bottom feeders you know and I involved myself with an ex-con who who's been charged with uh, uh, elderly abuse who's been charged with theft who's been charged with assault 10 seconds to go 10 seconds to go meet me over there guys meet me over there I'll see you guys on the next one just remember don't stop. Later, Gator. Later.